Hey everybody, one of the Silver Band on Adventure. I'm back with Jay, and we are once again hunting monsters in the dark. This time it's werewolves. It's the Lugaru Surprise, mission number eight. We're venturing into the deep dark woods to find massacred people and hunt down some monster slaying people in the dark. So I'll show you the mission, show you the table, and we'll get this underway. All right, so deep in the woods, there are a pile of seven clue markers, one in the center of the table, and then six more ringing it. Uh, which represent a massacre site of things, terrible things that have happened involving werewolves. So Jay and I are going to roll off, uh, place within two inches of a table edge, and on turn three, the howling begins, and stuff starts to arrive. Now we have to investigate as many clue markers as we can, slay the werewolves we find, and then try and exit after turn four uh, with clue markers if we can. Uh, you, sir, have the con. So, deploy your whole team within two. Those are pretty scary. They are quick healing two. Every time they activate, they heal two. Uh, they're strong. They have uh, nimble, so they ignore difficult terrain. They are um, hard uh, masters of cover, so they're minus two hit when they're in cover. Uh, they are plus two melee, plus zero shooting. Uh, defense 13 with 12 wounds, and they are damage reduction five, but allergic to silver and um, fire. All right, so you've deplaced all your guys over here. You've got McHaggis hanging out with one of the, actually he's paired up looks like all the chosen men. Uh, actually, we split a bunch of them up this time. So there's okay. McHaggis, there is uh, Cadet Colonel Deering with, oh, which one are you? You've forgotten Theopolis. He's on the sidelines still. There we go. I should have <laughs> yeah. eight figures. So we are going to, he'll go with McHaggis. As usual. That's how it's going to go. Yeah. They're like, it's, it, he's, uh, he's the Dr. Gonzo to um, the, <laughs> exactly. the, the, the McHaggis of, uh, of your, uh, what should I call it? Hunter S. I, I'll be here when you screw this up. That's right. Hunter S. McHaggis and Dr. Gonzo. Uh, Deering and uh, Butcher. And then we've got Cadet Captain Rogers with Lieutenant uh, Ta Lieutenant Tavington. And then Blythe. And then Blythe and Butcher holding up my left flank. Wicked. I've got uh, Delgado and Ramirez hanging out with one of my Grenadiers. The other two Grenadiers over here with Rubio and Briner. So it is turn one initiative. I got two. I got more than two. Then you, sir, are going first with half your team. And then Yoke. there's no monster on the table until turn three. So we can investigate the site until then and fight each other. Okie doke. Uh, so we are going to activate Cadet Colonel Deering. They are going to move and then attempt to move again. Running on a five. Gets it. Running just as fast Four as inches. they can. Yeah. Going again. Oh, what am I running one? for? No, you just move the whole thing. Move 12. Enough. Yeah, eight and then, or six and uh, then 12. four. Yeah. yeah. No, six and four is 10. 10. I'm sorry. I, I know how math works. I don't know how math works. I don't works. know how math. Keep it the middle going. So, six. And then run. Yeah. Four more. And then run. Running with the boss. Makes it. And, okay. Well then. So no monster phase. No monster phase, yep. So it's just back to us. And we're just gonna, you know, start liberally applying bullets. So go in here, and uh, we shall take a shot into that fella. I'll be at minus two, plus one with my Grenadier into your in-cover infantryman. that Colonel Deering. So he's at 12 for defense or 13? Uh, I believe just a 12, sorry. Okay. The one I'm minus one of this. Well, I definitely I definitely hit, because I roll a 16 and do nine damage. Would you like to reduce it? No. Okay. Nine damage, he's down to one. You could shoot back, however. Oh, that is my way. That is your way, yeah. So I have I have three, I have, no, I have three monster days, because I have two supernatural veterans now. I forgot about that. <laughs> and gun's back. Shot! Take that, Spaniard! Uh, no. Well, well uh, if it works once, it'll definitely work twice, right? Let's walk up with this Grenadier and take the same shot. Also looking at minus two plus one, so minus one overall, so I need to roll a 14 here on these two dice to hit you. Uh, that will also do nine damage. Wait, models can be killed and removed from the game? Your models can be killed and removed from the game. I, by, by shooting, what? even. Is there a thing in the book about this? <laughs> no, one, no one told me. <laughs> that man is uh, suffering critical existence failure. No. I, didn't, I didn't sign up for that. Why is this game so violent? <laughs> so I'm going to go with Briner. Uh, he's going to move and then run. So he passes his run roll. So he's going to go with grand total of 10, so 8 plus 2, and just be in base contact with us at the end. I'll go with um, Rubio. He'll also run his old man legs. So he's going to go 6 to here, and then another 4. Get behind the don't behind forget, the hill. Don't forget, too, that was a casualty you inflicted, because there's a difference for, yeah, between for all three, monsters. That's right, yeah, yeah. All my sapper. And the boss, so we'll go with um, my sapper first, going six. And he'll try and run and pass, so he's going to go eight plus two, basically. We'll get on this objective. 
Uh, the boss, trying to run as well, makes it with a seven, so he'll go eight plus two and just get in cover behind this box. And then my last grenadier is gonna try and thread the needle. Get up there, get in the war. Tavington! I see you, Tavington. Uh, so minus two for cover, plus one for range, or Tavington plus one for guns. master of cover. Oh no, that's when I shoot you. Uh, no, 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 that's you. Plus minus three overall, plus one, so I need to roll a 17. That is not a 17. Be back. For this right. affront against the king. So you shall be uh, plus two, minus one. Okay. Because you didn't move. Oh, you did move this turn. He did move, yes, right, he has yeah. already moved. He has already so plus two, turn. minus plus two. two, so he's just a straight roll. And your defense 13. is? 13. Uh, that's a 13. That'll do it for and seven. Seven, yeah. Oh, I think we'll just take it. I gotta pray for that, so four damage left. Uh, I can die for cover, which I will. Oh, I'm just right. gonna snuggle up into the trees there. All you remaining guys. Okie doke. Uh, we'll just go left, right? Okay. Keep it simple, because there's no other threats. So we'll go... For now. Six. <laughs> <laughs> the howl uh, oh, Double. Oh, he's, he critical runs. He's critical running. <laughs> Gets a burst of speed. And then move. Up six. And then critical running as well. Uh, Barely. No, That's an 11. does make it, yes. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> Hunter S. Nakagas. Uh, yeah. Doesn't stop there because it's werewolf country. <laughs> Going four more. And then and Dr. Gonzo. Diabolus. Six and. Oh, yes. Of course. Got the legs. Got the, like got pushing him from behind. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Nakagas! He's got a lizard tail right now. <laughs> right, round two. Uh, it is a new turn. And uh, next turn, werewolves arrive. Oh, I got a. That's a, also a seven. And we try again. I got a three this time. I got a seven again, because that's all I roll. You can go first all the time. Okay. Make, make bad choices. Uh, so we're going to move McHaggis. My double dog dare you. Whoa! And then he would like to know what that is. All right. And what? I, that's an arm, sir. My card, it is an this arm carrying. spades! A werewolf! I like someone was eating that arm. The only card I need was the ace of spades. Well, that... Right, bro! Huh. I have bad news. It's werewolf in time. Uh, huh. <laughs> well, you All right. Three more guys can go. <laughs> so we will go with... You are... Uh, butcher? So Butcher is, uh, he likes clue markers. He likes clue markers? <laughs> All day he does. Um, Queen of Spades. Uh oh. Which is a bag of silver shot. Well, that timing convenient. is great. That's very convenient. So that was action one. That is not his smoke trail. No. Nope. <laughs> nope. So action two will be to take his bag of silver shot. <laughs> hey, I've got something for this. Don't shoot worry. you in the werewolf. All right. Uh, Def 13. Def 13 plus two. Did not move this Didn't turn. Did move this turn, yep. So you're looking for 11. 11. Uh, oh, is it worth a try? No, that's too much of a long shot for me. Okay. Yes. Oh, he, he's coming for you, though. He goes two. Woo! So Rogers will grab that. Okay, and see what it is. Maybe I should stop turning these over for a minute. I mean, who knows? <laughs> Could also be back a silver shot. Nine of That's spades. a small silver cross. Add a power die to your fate pool. Um, and then for his... Second action, he is going to move thusly. He'd like to be the mayor of Werewolf Town. Okay. Okay. Uh, Tavington will reload because he already has Silver Shot. That's right. <laughs> He's like, I brought something for this, Werewolf. Uh, and Tavington is. It's an 11. Plus two. plus two, I think. Yep. Yeah, he is plus two. Hitting on 11. Oh, oh, sir. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you tend to hit. You roll both. You spend two dice and roll both dice. I am not going to do Kay. that. Well, Even my hubris has limits. <laughs> Fair enough. This isn't a space shotgun. <laughs> One, two. I think that was four. Yeah, that is four. Yeah, I'm sorry. All right. Uh, well, monster phase. You get what did I ever do to you? Oh god, I interrupted your lunch. I'm so sorry. Wolfie. <laughs> That's right. Oh, Wolfie. <laughs> so it's going to be plus two. Hitting on a... What is it? 13? The Haggis is a 13. It's an 11. Oh. <laughs> Oh! I have bad news. I'm declaring shenanigans on that. Uh, McHaggis takes 10 damage because it's strong. Yep, so he's got two left. 
Would he like to fight back? Oh, he's gonna fight back. This is the mother superior and dog soldier scene happening right now. Scottish martial art of headbutting it and swearing at <laughs> right, werewolf. Do it. Do uh, so he is also plus two. Oh, 11 damage, but it's damage reduction five. <laughs> I'll take it. So, so that's he's six. down to six remaining. Uh, no, he has six. only health 12. All numbers are six. Yep, he goes down to six remaining health. But he will get two back at the start of his next activation. Whoa, whoa. You get to go again, as do I. I get to I. use all my non-silver weapons <laughs> to try and stop this. <laughs> uh, so that was the monstering phase, so it's over to me. Um, so what do I... Oh, so he didn't die, so you. So he could choose to back out, but he won't because he's a werewolf. So now it right, is... Why would you? <laughs> right, you yeah. So now it is my turn. Uh, we're going to go with, I guess, the whole team. So Delgado is going to go. He's going to search this thing and see what we find. I find the King of Spades, which is Bag a silver, silver shot. shot. Treat all the investigating figures shooting attacks as silver for the rest of the scenario. So that one's removed. Uh, and then he could take an action. He will. He's going to move to... And then he has Nimble, so he's going to go up to there. Boss is going to go. He's going to walk up to here and investigate. He will find the Jack. A silver knife! All my melee attacks are silver nice. for this game. I already had a silver melee weapon, that's still cool. And then we'll go with, I guess, Ruby. No, we'll not go with Rubio. We'll go with Bryna. Bryna's coming for you, Wolfie. So he's gonna move in, and then he's gonna run. Just run two to get into melee. Uh, then we'll go with this Grenadier. He won't reload, he'll walk over to this and just investigate. He finds. Eight of spades. Silver ramrod. Silver Admiral. cross. Oh, silver. Eight of spades? Silver ramrod. A skill ram die. All right, so go to three. And then we're going to reload and take a shot up top. So I didn't move, uh, So, uh, but you are obscured by this thing, so it'll be minus one. So I'm going straight and dice against that guy. 13. 13. Negative. I'm going to reroll both. Oh, look at you. Yeah, 12 is a miss. Because <laughs> I cover. I'll let you moxie, though. Uh, I almost got there. He's not fired. Uh, and this little guy will just reload. And move into cover. And then over here, Rubio's gonna go. He's just gonna go hide behind this wall and then pray to heal him. On a 10, adding his will. That'll do it. So he goes up to seven health remaining. Oh, Dive cover, for, I mean closer. Dive for cover where he wants to be, yeah, that makes sense. All right, your second half of the, the dude's going. Absolutely. Uh, well, we'll save the best for last. Um, so it's one, two, who have I lost track of? Three, you guys haven't gone. Who else hasn't gone? Is it him? Did he not go this No, he way? shot the wolf. You're down a guy. So you've I'm gone. down a guy, thank you. you. That's, you, you my, that's three, my problem. It's three and three, yeah. Okay, so we're going to move. You just investigated that clue marker. I don't care for yeah, that. Yeah, so it'd be him and Theopolis. These two. Yeah. And Theopolis. So we're going to move. Oh, yeah, you better. Uh, and then that is Tanner. Tanner is going to shoot you in the Spaniard. Do it. Def 14. Uh, you move. two. So you're minus one, so plus one. So you need a 13 here. He's Point blanking Delgado. That's it. Keep it for close encounters. Uh, <gasps> not as bad as it looks, though. I know, because so it's skill. I am going to reroll that. That makes sense. Yep. Don't get worse. Don't get cocky. <laughs> so he's a three plus still hit. And there That's you go. Six damage. I'll spend a skill die and reduce it by five. So I'll only take damage. one. I have 13 remaining. Of my, oh no, I have 13 health, so I have 12 remaining. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come for you. Thank you. Do it. Do it. Do it. I dare you. And then second shot. I'm just <laughs> running out of space. Yep, for yep. That. <laughs> uh, Guns. So Nine will miss. Is Eleven. You can reroll your power die. You have 13, you have 7 plus. Or die in a second. Okay. Okay. So my remaining guy, Dr. Theopolis. Go get him, Theopolis. Enough of you, Wolfie. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> and then Dr. Theopolis will take his plain old ordinary sword and use it to finish that werewolf. Do it. You only need to roll an 11 damage. <laughs> and I I'm crit. I'm plus one melee, and he is minus one defense. Okay. Because you have a friend there, that's right. He's defense 12. Uh, I am gonna reroll that. Okay. And two power dice left. So you have seven here with your plus one melee and you're outnumbering from your friend. Here comes the ten. Do it. Ten. Drop it. Oh, 
Oh, so close. Uh, so eight. So uh, minus five is three, three damage. damage. He's got three remaining. But he does fight back. Uh, so he's indefatigable, which means he does not suffer the penalty for being the tired. Defense 13. Uh, so he's only plus one melee right now because he's basic tired. Uh, that's, that's, a, eight. that's a 15. Eight, nine for strong. No, so he has two remaining. He can choose to back off. Uh, he can't strike back now, but you could will, back off. actually. Burr. That's turn. That is turn. All right, so three. I think it's top of the baddies arrive. End of the third turn. We place a wolf in each table corner and one werewolf in the center of the two table, which is not being used by us. First, first, first we'll still get It's probably going to try and jump this werewolf, yeah. Oh. Let's see who's going first. Turn three. Is you? <laughs> Angus, Angus was waiting for your back to be turned. Uh, yeah, so we are going to activate McHaggis first. Okay. And he's going to get his stab on. <laughs> That's only got three elf left. Um, so there's no friend this time. Nope. Uh, but he is plus two on his own. Pull! So that is a 13. That is a 13. 10 damage. Ten minus damage, five minus is five. five damage. Finishes off Wolf. I'll take that Wolf. <laughs> Thank you, sir. So you've killed the first of the wolves. Still has an action left. Yeah, so I am going to move. Uh, actually, I guess I'm going to move that Let's way. Go get some leeches. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, you got any leeches? So then... Oh, what do I do first? What do I do first? What do I do first? So you got three actions right now, so you got two left. That's, that's, right. that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. right. Um, I keep seeing. I keep not seeing the guy behind the tree over here. Right. Uh, right thing. So Doctor Theopolis will spend his round healing McHaggis. Right. They just killed a werewolf together. They're bonding over it. All right. And, and so, how much do you heal? Complete. Four on McHaggis. Okay. So that's one, two. Uh, then we will. Reload and shoot the Kool-Aid man. Reload. <laughs> shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Briner's getting shot. 14. Uh, and I'm plus two. You are plus two. Yeah. I have not moved. moved. I'm in the open. That Ooh. is a three, which is not slightly great. less than 14. Uh, so I will, um, I think, shoot back with my pistol. Plus one hit. Uh, so you are defense 13. Cover for 14. I haven't moved this turn. I was going to miss. I'm just going to grab that objective and see what it is. The last one. So the Ten of Spades. That is a Necklace of Teeth at a Monster Dice to the Fate Pool. So we got three. And then... Tavington. Uh, he's still got an action. That was his oh, first sorry, that's action. Right, yeah. So he is going to fall back. Yeah, like we found all the clues. Now he's got to face the werewolves. Oh, and he's not wounded at all, eh? Oh, I don't like any of this. I mean, he's wounded once. He's slightly wounded. <laughs> oh, no, I meant him. <laughs> oh, oh, no, no, Briner's, mm -hmm. Briner's coming for you. <laughs> Reload. Yep. And fire. Point blank the boss. Yeah. Do it. And that is a 12. You need a 14. You need a power die. Go for something higher. It is eight damage if you do it, which is huge. Nope. Nope. Missed. Well, guess what? I'm shooting back from a blunderbuss. Now, here's the thing with the blunderbuss. <laughs> it hits everything in a straight line. Minus one hit, minus one for cover. So minus two overall, uh, and it shoots both these guys. So, or I could shoot Tavington. Nah, I'll shoot both those guys in the front. So just unload the blunderbuss. Um, so I'm plus two to hit, minus two. So I need a 13, or are you 12 with the chosen man? They're 13. Okay. Front one, 13. Oh, I'll reroll the power die. Nope, my last power die, and then against the guy in the back on a 13. Uh, that's a 13. Nine damage. That takes nine, goes to a two. Uh, he, yeah, correct. I've spent my blunderbuss. All right, so now it's over to me because the monsters are off table. Well, we've investigated all the investigation, so let's start with the boss. He reloads and fires his blunderbuss again. <laughs> on a 13 into that guy. Uh, seven. So he'll have four left. And then into the wounded guy, also on a 13. Uh, oh no, I didn't move this time. It's not 12. Okay. Six more damage. So oh no, 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 never mind. Actually, it was still on a 13. Oh. Okay. I'll reroll the skill die. Okay. I'm going to try and get this, try and finish this guy off. I need a seven plus to hit here. No. Work live. Uh, and then Way to not die. you could shoot back with him. Oh, I he's unloaded. He could dive for cover. Uh, yes, and dive for cover this time is actually going to mean move backwards. Bye. 
So I just move there. And then, yeah, Blythe will return fire. Do it. Well, that's right, they're, that's both, they're both unloaded. That's right, yeah, yeah. So, so everybody here is unloaded now with just the so one smoke marker. Fall back. There's just smoke everywhere. Okay. Uh, I think you're just going to light a torch and then move over here. The howling is getting louder. Rubio's going to pray and try and heal that guy. He does yet again, so he's got 10 remaining. Rubio's just going to kind of dither. <laughs> and then we're going to reload and move. Oh, I know what reload and light a torch. You know what howling means. <laughs> and then reload and light a torch over here as well. Uh, and then I think it's just the Kool-Aid man. And he's going to undoctor the doctor. He's not going to reload his gun. He's just going to charge in. I see your sword is as big as mine. Foolish. <laughs> and so, defense uh, on Theobulus. 13. Uh, I'm plus two to this. That's an eight. I'll reroll the skill die. Last reroll. See if I can get it. That's a 14. 15. Okay, so I will spend five damage. A skill die. Oh, he's gonna try and drop it to reduce the damage. Okay, so you have to drop. Uh, you have to release a six plus here. Oh, some some plus. No, no. he's dead. And oh. Of the oh yeah, we have a giant sword fight. I'm all done. So it's just you guys who haven't gone yet. Yep. Uh, so we will activate. So we'll do Blythe first. He'll okay. reload. Yep. And then he is gonna fall back. Oops. Like we've we found what we needed. We've killed a werewolf. Everything's great. Tanner? Tanner, I think. Marching? Butcher. Butcher. Reload and shoot the Kool-Aid man. <laughs> <laughs> Plus two. I'm in the open. Need a 14. That's a 12? 12. Is it 14? Plus two is 14. Yeah, you got me. Uh, and that's nine damage. Brrr, I can't stop that, so I go down to five. And I dive for cover. <laughs> the boss, much the same thing. Yep. I see. I see. You're not immune to guns. <laughs> Plus two. Plus two. I will oh. not do it. It's a six. Uh. Briner's yeah. coming. Do you have roll? Yeah, I'm just coming. The last power do it. Briner's coming. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's only gonna be four damage. So never mind. Okay. Briner's coming. Briner's still coming. <laughs> Is turn except for whatever shows up at the end all right a wolf in every corner and a werewolf on either middle of the table so werewolf here a werewolf here and every corner gets a uh, dire wolf or dark wolf i'm not saying things are going bad but things aren't going great turn four dire that's right so let's see who's going first initiative oh Whoa, finally a two finally uh, all right well you guys are dead well well I mean... I didn't win initiative once. For, <laughs> you won initiative every turn. <laughs> All right, we're going to go with the boss, or with uh, Rubio. He's going to climb for four, and then just move two more. And pray at Briner. Briner! Deus Vault! Indeed, Deus Vault. Briner heals up to eight, and then Briner's, Briner's coming for you. Hey, Skippy. <laughs> All right, plus I'm two to... Butcher, are you? Plus two to... That's right, Billy Defense Butcher. 13. Defense 13, I'm plus two. Uh, that's gonna be a 1415. I do uh, six damage with my greatsword. Five, Five left. You wanna strike back or fall back? No, I wanna strike back. Okay. <laughs> Hit on a 14. Rifle butt to the face. That's it. Bayonet. In your face! Bayonet. Oh, that'll do it for eight. Eight. Holy crap. Uh, I only have eight left. I have no dice. So you just killed me. Got smacked right in the face. There's two activations. I've got two left. Well, you know, I think uh, I think the boss is gonna reload, and then he's gonna bang bang. So blunderbussing, I'm minus two, minus three for cover, plus two, so minus one against so him. Tanner's defense thirteen. So I need a fourteen to hit him. Uh, that'll do it. Six damage. Uh, yeah. And then it is defense fourteen for Tanner. All right, so no cover now, so just a zero. So I need to roll a straight fourteen. No, you're unloaded, so you could die for cover if you want. Uh, yeah, I'm actually gonna, I've got all my stuff I want. I'm and I'm out of bullets again. Got one left, everybody's got torches. Except you, do you, are you equipped with torches? You have a musket card, you're gonna up in a strange candelabra, so no, you don't have torches. So you're just gonna move to here, and you're gonna shoot a gun into McHaggis. Shoot him right in the haggis. At plus one. Uh, plus two because I moved. Uh, that's yeah, that's uh, very seven points of damage. 
You can spend your last power die. No. Nope. Oh, he's down. And we are done, except for our second half. So it is monster in time. So these guys, I think the wolves all move eight. The wolves move six. So they all go eight towards the closest thing they can see. Bark barking. And then these guys go six. Bean werewolves. I think he's the closest, actually. Which is not great for me. Uh, and it's yours. No, it's your entire crew. All right. <laughs> Just deuces. <laughs> you, 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 you run two. Yeah, you run two. Yeah, bye. So he's fine. He's in the safe pile. Tappington. I'm going to go six. <laughs> oh, no. I'm being left to fight them all alone. And he's Enjoy gone. your werewolf, Spaniards. <laughs> uh, I'm sure it will all be fine. And then gets to run if he wants. Does two or four? Not quite. And then the last infantryman. So he will run. Oops. <laughs> the sound of wolves are traditional spooking for the English. Uh, oh, it just makes just it barely. Four more. Well then, uh, it's looking like my second half. So. I guess we take some shots on the way in. Over here, uh, we're going to take a shot into the werewolf. It is defense 13, so I need plus one. I need a 12. Uh, that's going to hit with a 12. It'll do five damage, but it's damage reduction five, so it does no damage. And then it just creeps towards me. I'll reload my second action. Uh, then over here, I'll shoot the dire wolf in cover, so plus one, minus one. I don't actually know what I need, but that's not going to do it. Yeah, and then more I'll than that. And then I'll, and then I'll re I, you know what, I'll back off and just be unloaded. So it just moves towards me as I shoot it. And then over here, shooting into him. Uh, that's going to do it. 17 damage reduction 5. It takes 4 damage and has 8 left of its 12. But then it dodges towards me. And I'll reload my second action. It's one, two, three. That was everybody. Because I only had seven guys. So it is new turn. Some wolfies might catch us. Let's see who's going first. Turn five. It's you first. All right. Well, half my force is one guy now. <laughs> so one guy is going to have to fight a wolf. And what? one guy is leaving. So he's going to leave. <laughs> uh, then it's monstering time. So I think you get wolves. Stand and deliver! <laughs> that wolf's going to come get you. Eight. Easily. And then fight chat plus. What was dark wolf? Plus one? Plus one to hit. It's gonna use a die to reroll that power die. Needs a 13, so it needs to roll an uh, eight here. No. Is it back off or I'm straight back? back and <laughs> say peace. It's gonna go eight. Seven. Eight. Uh, then this werewolf comes to fight the boss, who does have a silver weapon conveniently. Uh, plus two to hit, and you can monster die these. Yes, I can. And I got three monster dice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, nine? You can reroll the two? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. You need to hit a 14 here. He's to five. We'll do it. Six. So that's going to be plus one for strong. Seven, seven points damage. of damage. I'm going to take some down to five. He will strike back with his silver sword. Hitting at plus two. So he needs to hit a 11 to hit. Uh, that'll that's do it. Lot. Uh, so six damage. It's got six remaining. Uh, silver weapon. So we don't reduce it at all. We're both tired, or I'm tired now. Uh, then this dire wolf's gonna run up eight and just go around. This dire wolf's gonna get me. So plus one. That is Ooh, a 14. one health 15. remains. Fighting back nine ten don't hit. Uh, so it survived but stays in melee. I have one health remaining. Oh no! And this werewolf, the closest will still be over here. Uh, it's nimble, but it doesn't quite make it into combat. It's just on top of these boxes. Great. My whole team goes. Well, first of all, Rubio's going to pray this guy doesn't die. Because that would suck. Uh, he sure does. This guy gets four health left. I probably should have prayed over here. Um, then, speaking of which, we'll go with... I guess he could move. Uh, yeah, he'll get a little further away from all that. Uh, we're going to reload with the Sapper Delgado, and he's going to shoot this... Where he's got a plus one to hit. It's in cover though, so it's minus two. So minus one overall. Nothing. And then it moves towards him. Burk burk. Over here, piling in to save his friend against the dire wolf. Hitting at plus one. Defense 12. Actually, defense 11. Doesn't matter, didn't hit. His friend will do much the same thing. 
Oh, sorry, he could fight back first against him. Well, I'm I'm sorry. Yeah, the wolf does. I missed, I missed the second attack, too. Yeah. So fight back against the first guy. Plus one. A 13. That would be a 12. Uh, you could monster die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, sorry. Oh. Just the four, yeah. yeah. Uh, that'll do eight points of damage. He's down to two. Three actually has 11. And then you can also strike back against this other guy who missed. Okay. Oh, I'm yeah. getting werewolves. Uh, nine is bad. That was a nine. It so was an 18. 18. He's just dead. Things are not going well. Okay, well, uh, let's see if the boss can kill a werewolf. Up here. Hitting on a plus two. Ugh, that's a 10. Doesn't hit the 13 he needs. You can strike back. Werewolf you back? Sure can. No one left. I know. Uh, I can roll it. Yep. Three again? All right, last monster die. Go get him. Seven? Strong eight? Just kills him. Down he goes. Oh, back when he activates. That's right, yeah. So this guy goes to 10. Wait, the start oh, got it. Uh, you no, know, he would still have actually yeah, hit the sorry. same amount. My bad. This guy would have actually gone back to 10. Well, okay then. Uh, I think that's all my god. Oh no, this guy over here. He's got a burning weapon. He's going to go try and stab him. Just hit him with a torch. It'll be fine. Everything's fine. Everything's great. He's tired now, so he's only defense 12. Let's see if I can finish him off. The boss couldn't do it, but I can. Oh, he's oh! Oh, 10 damage. He, he didn't know he never becomes exhausted. Oh, he never man. becomes exhausted, but we killed him with a 10. Straight up what we needed to hit. Good job. All right. Uh, that's everybody. So you have your team leaves. Yep. <laughs> and we are left holding the proverbial bag. Turn six. Uh, it's just me. Enjoy your wolves. I, I, I get to go first with half of everybody. Uh, it's time to go. So we're going to go six. Oh. oh, away, and then we're going to pray. See if we can heal that yeah. guy. Uh, he's healed. I thought you were Can't pray the wolves aren't real. The wolves definitely real. We're going to reload, and then run six with Nimble. Wolves happen, so those two run eight towards the guys they can see. Uh, probably him. Uh, then this guy fights me, finishes me off. Oh, oh no. all right. Uh, I'm not going to monster die that. I'll strike. No, I'll just break off. <laughs> yep. I'll just stay here. No, 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 wait, then, wait, wait. Then this werewolf is going to come after me and also attack. Uh, it heals to full. Uh, that is a 15. Four? Four, four, four? Five points of damage. We'll kill him. Yeah, he's dead. Uh, then over here, we're going to move run. So we're going to go six and then run. We haven't done that one. Oh, sorry. He'll monster. go into the sapper over here. Yep. Uh, 14. 14, that'll hit him for six, six. points. So he's going to have, Delgado is 12, he'll have six left. He's just going to break off and back away. No, thank you. Now this Grenadier runs, so he'll go grant total 10, so this plus two. And just stand in front of Rubio. No, thanks. Uh, yeah, well, we get to go again with half our guys. So Rubio's going to pray at him. He does, he goes up to nine. <laughs> then Rubio's gonna run away six, because you're not on the table anymore, so this is all just me exiting. Uh, then we're gonna go with Delgado, he's gonna go six and then run, and not get to move extra, so he only goes eight total, and goes to here. And then all the monsters go. This one's here, so this dire wolf comes and fights my grenadier. Already went. That was your second this half. is a new turn, because oh, I go first. Sorry. I automatically go first with half, right? So then it's you, because you're not on the table anymore. Uh, Ten will not hit. Needs a 13, does a 12, or 11, I'll back off. Uh, the werewolf comes, six. This guy goes eight, and then you lost two werewolves, go. And then we leave. No, we don't leave. We don't, we never leave. We're gonna back up, because I need to leave with two people to start the next turn. I'm gonna shoot over here. <laughs> shoot the dire wolf. Oh, that's not even the right die. <laughs> 10, uh, 11, no, miss. Creeps up two. And then start the next turn, both these guys leave, so Delgado and Rubio walk off. All these monsters attack me. So this one comes after me. Roll to hit. I need to back off. Uh, eight won't do it, so we'll back off an inch. I don't think that keeps me safe. Not quite. So the werewolf comes. Oh, oh it's the wolf time. Oh, man. Okay, well, 
We lost the war and we definitely didn't. The alpha got us with his four little babies and drove us out after everybody went away. But we both took horrific casualties yeah, I, in that I one. took two games worth of casualties yeah. easily. Yeah. I, I actually caused most of your casualties, but the werewolves caused most of mine. You killed Briner with shooting. Uh, and I think that's it. I think the rest of these are actually werewolf casualties. Once yeah. That, not getting none. So I'm going to get the bonus XP for the kills. We both killed a werewolf, which is one. That's one. And we anyone who left we that searched something. And we both we'll investigated one. two or more clue markers. That's right. So for one. So that's one, two, I'll get three, four for the kills, five for a werewolf, six for walking off. Four, because I think those guys were the, yeah. So I've got four plus my one. Okay. More importantly, who's dead? <laughs> All right. Well, let's uh, see who dies and who's great. So Delgado and Rubio living. What happens to the boss? Dead. But I can choose to add one to this. He's just dead. Yeah, there's no way to reroll it. I'm just gone. Um, so then I guess we do Briner. What happens to Briner? This was a big game. Two, uh, permanent injury. Rolling the permanent injury table. Briner got a piece taken out of him. It is an eight. Jitters. Jitters. Minus one courage. Courage is now zero. And then it's my three other heroes. So, or sorry, my three... Um, uh, Grenadiers. So Ortiz, gun up, seven, full recovery, full recovery. Uh, then Torres, full, full recovery. recovery, and then finally Ramos, dead. Also dead. Ramos <laughs> died, uh, and I just drastically dropped in tier. Dr. Theopolis. Okay, it's been a big game, big things happening, dead, and no! Oh, no! We got some painting to do, man. <laughs> um... So this is just like Dog Soldiers. <laughs> it is Dog Soldiers. Good at Colonel Deering. Uh, okay. Eight is, is fine. Yep. Um, oh, Angus. McHaggis. Angus. Four? Uh, four is slow recovery, so minus starts next game with minus three health. Yep. Oh, no problem. Dr. Oh, oh, I made myself sad inside. Oh. <laughs> and and then, then... Blythe? No. No. Tanner. No. You are... Tanner. Yep. Tanner. Dead. Also dead. So we both had two people die. Two big named characters. Oh, the survivors limp away with lots of experience though. So everybody got two experience points, which means Briner got a upgrade and went to plus three melee. He's barely sane anymore. He's at zero health, but he's an absolute killing machine uh, with his nimble silver weapon, holy symbol pistol and hand weapon. Uh, and then Delgado got an accuracy. He's actually melee plus zero, but uh, he's gotten better at shooting now. Uh, and still has his strange candelabra. Now losing the silver cross sucked on um, Ramirez because that was a key piece of equipment and I have to make a new officer now to lead the group. No level ups for you? No level ups for me. Um, but we're both gonna have to go and paint and reorganize now. Yeah, because... I, I lost a chosen man uh, who is a decent number. I forget if he's 15 or 18. Yeah, and... he's worth, I thought he was worth two uh, other guys almost. Yeah, and the doctors are actually only worth 10. He's the same as an infantryman. But, right. Uh, yeah, definitely need to add some guys for the final two scenarios. That's it. So the final two scenarios, we're gonna reorganize all the new leader limp in at the last minute and take over um, the Spanish team. Now let's drop my tier from three, six, nine. 10, 11, 11 from 14. All right, so there we go at the end of the game. Mass casualties on both sides. Dr. Theopolis and Lieutenant Ramirez both being killed and two missions remaining. We're gonna have to rejigger our list. So I'm gonna have to do some painting, paint up a new leader. Jay's gonna have to find out uh, who's going to be replacing the good doctor to feed cocaine and leeches to everybody. And we'll be back with the final two missions of Silver Bayonet uh, starting in two weeks. Big thanks for watching. Thanks a lot, Mash. Hey there, I hope you enjoyed that video. There are tons of other games all recorded for you to watch. Click over to my channel page if you haven't already and have a look to the dozens of playlists full of videos. I guarantee you'll discover a game you haven't seen played before. I put out new videos seven days a week and every day is themed to a different genre as I continue to explore the wider world of gaming. Of course, none of that's possible without you, the viewer, so click a like and subscribe if you'd like to stay on top of what's happening here daily. My two kids and I are massively grateful to be able to have the flexibility of this job so I can always maximize my time with them. If you want to support me continuing to put out this content, it's only possible because of my amazing backers on Patreon who support the studio, equipment, and model cost, as well as being how I make the bulk of my living. You can also help out by buying a t-shirt through Spreadshirt, a measuring gauge or widget from Death Ray Designs, or buying one of my games and supplements like Last Days, Gamma Wolves, and Blaster. 
As a way of showing my appreciation, patrons get early access to new games and supplements that I write throughout the course of the year. Huge thanks for watching, it really does help out, and happy gaming.